Welcome to the Village Economy in Daba, held on November 1, 2024, at Mailia Kopne. This exciting event was founded by Dr. Kwake Zora Hudwi and Dr. Mashao Makura, two visionary leaders dedicated to empowering rural communities. Today we are honored to have Hosi Mavi Omolopjani from Mavi Skral joining us alongside Executive Mayor Sheila Mabali Huma of the Rustenburg Local Municipality. But today, as we are gathered here, we are not just gathered for because of, of, a, of a mere concept or to discuss a concept. However, we are here today to, to ignite a movement because we believe that this will be a game changer where we find ourselves. We believe that we are no longer marginalized, but we are able and we can show forth and be seen. If you want to see improvement in any kind of aspect in your life, you need to sweat. You need to put in the work and ensure that things are done. And I want to start by opening the session to say, mediocrity is not going to be part of the village economy in Daba. Yes. I want to say to all the stakeholders that have joined us this morning, this afternoon, we are intentional with the work that we want to do. Yes. We are intentional with the key objectives that we want to fulfill as the village economy in Daba. We are not going to come here and offer long messages, offer long keynote addresses. We want to see action. Executive Mayor Sheila Mabali Huma emphasized the importance of supporting Dr. Kogetzora Hulu's plan to uplift the community, highlighting the potential for economic growth and development. Today, we are launching for the first time an initiative by a young person from a village. Many at times people that are coming from village have been taken as nobody. But at least today, Hosanna, and we are going to support you as the municipality. And I agree with you that those don't want, those who don't want to come in, those who still have questions on what exactly is this, those who still have questions on who is benefiting and I'm not benefiting, they are not going to listen to them because that is the tendency of our people. When there are good initiatives, the question that you ask, we are not going to support that because Sarakudu is benefiting, whereas Sarakudu is doing it for or on your behalf as people of uh, Opman. This platform fosters collaboration, innovation and growth, enriching the local economic and improving lives. SMMEs are thrilled to showcase their innovative businesses, grateful for the opportunity to associate with government villagers and expand their networks. Uh, I'm a business development manager there. So uh, why we are here, we are here just for impact. We came to just create impact. Classic Oriental is a business development company. We impact SMMEs, we impact the economy by developing SMMEs and creating capacity within themselves and businesses as a whole. So we are quite glad. Thank you to Hosana, the community of Tizing, and you guys for, for really inviting us. We are quite glad to be here. Thank you so much and, and uh, let's go for impact. That's the only way. Thanks. Hi, my name is Komoto Siogeza and I'm from Petulia Bupelo, which is a foundation face for Tsirilujo Disability Group. It's an honor for us today as two institutions to actually come to Maile and attend this very fruitful um, function, which is the village economy in Daba. And what um, we take away from this, it's a question of unification as institutions, as the community and as the country and looking at our expertise from our side um, as Sirulujo as well as Petuloya Bupelo. Village economy in Daba, building a stronger, more sustainable future for our communities. For Naledi News, I'm Bonolo Ngedlang.